everyone and welcome back to the Tech Enthusiast channel. Today I will guide you through easy Windows desktop customization and all the files used in this video will be linked in video description down below and while you are down there don't forget to click on the like button for the YouTube algorithm of course. With that said let's begin. Let's start with customizing the cursor. So open up your web browser and search for the VS Cursor 12.0. Here on DeviantArt click on free download button. Of course if you want to download this file you will need a DeviantArt account. Now go to your downloads folder, right click on this zip file, click on the extract all, then extract once again. So in this extracted folder, open up the cursors and preview folder. Now go to the VS Cursor 12.0 folder and here right click on the install file and click install right here. Then click open, click yes right here and the brand new cursor should be installed. So to change the cursor, open up the start and search for the control panel. Click on the control panel and here search for the mouse. It should be on your left. And now go to the pointers and here under the scheme select the VS Cursor 12.0. Click apply, click yes and click OK. So here you have a brand new cursor. So if you want to uninstall your cursor, go to the mouse once again, click to the pointers and click here delete. So this is pretty much it for the cursor and right now let's continue with the widgets for our desktop. Before installing any of the Rainmeter skins make sure that you have the Rainmeter actually installed and then go ahead on your web browser and search for the Mond Rainmeter theme. Down below you can see this download button which is patent blue. Click on the Mond Rainmeter skin installer and install it. So here you should see a few of the settings for this month theme pack. Click on the 24 hour clock and also for the Celsius. Then click close settings and now go ahead to your desktop. So here you can see three elements of the month theme the date or the clock, then you have the player and of course the recycle bin. We are going to use only one, the date, so I will right click on the player, click unload skin and same for the recycle bin. Right click on this specific skin, then click edit skin and right now I will modify a few parameters. Here I will remove measure time and scroll down till you see meter 24 hour clock and of course meter 12 hour clock. Here I will choose both of them and remove this code, click Ctrl plus S. If you want you can make this skin a little bit larger or smaller, so click Edit Skin. And here make sure that you change the scale. So for example I will scale this up a little bit to the 1.26. Now you can go to the file, make sure that you save it. Now close the notepad, right click on the skin, refresh the skin and it should be larger. So here we have the Mon skin, I will place it to the center of the desktop, something like that. And now let's go ahead to the second rain meter skin, which is called Drop Top 4. So basically go to their GitHub website, here under the releases, click on the Drop Top basic version and also click here to download the Drop Top skin. So click on the installer, click install and here we have the configuration file. Click continue here, here pick your preferred language. Here I will pick only desktop and here I will select my preferred media player Spotify. Here I will select Celsius and type in let's say London and then click continue. Here I will pick this windows icon and of course the size of the drop down bar will be small as well. Click continue here and here we have choose a color option. I will click here default because we will still modify a few settings within the drop top skin itself. So click here maybe later and we are good to go. Click finish setup and the drop top skin should show on the desktop. Here we have the drop top skin at the top. Click on this windows icon, click drop top settings and here I will select the theme and I will change it to transparent. Apply this theme but now we can see that we have this text which is colored in black but I will change it right now to the white. Click to the drop top settings, 
go to the color and opacity and make sure that you select here set color by desktop wallpaper and uncheck that and make sure that you also select here top bar text and put everything to the max something like that i think it looks better already and now we still need to add the final widget to the desktop which is from jack score so go ahead on the github website click to releases and click on the rain meter skin install it and then we are going to go through the jack score hub here we have the setup wizard click on the skip setup wizard which is quite badly visible now go to the library and make sure that you click this modular players skin and now you can click this green downland arrow on the top right so here i have modular player skin installed make sure that you click on the top left to activate the skin now you can go to the general and here we have a few styles to pick from here i will just pick this one windows 11 and now i will make this one smaller so we can see skin clearly so here we have the skin i will go to the style and options here i will select the rounding which is currently set on the non i will set it to the standard and i will also disable the windows stroke so here i think it looks quite nice and i will also change this blur variant to the standard and make sure that you have under the media tab here select here modern and also player will be always visible make sure that this is turned off now we can center this widget so here i will go align horizontally centered and i will also put it somewhere here at the bottom we still need to add a taskbar modification to that as well so to fix that open up your web browser and search for the taskbar 11 from the chris here go to the releases tab on this github page and make sure that you download both of the exe files so once you got both of the exe files make sure that you select both of them right click and cut the files then you will go to the, your local disk c create a brand new folder i will call it tweaks press enter and paste it right here both of the files and here make sure that you first run the taskbar xi exe file and then you can run the configurator here i only recommend to enable one option which is sticky and this is pretty much it click apply here and then you can close the configurator and also the file explorer if i minimize the window you can see that we have this beautiful desktop to remove everything showed in this video open up your start menu here search for the control panel here make sure that you click uninstall a program and before uninstalling the rain meter we still need to stop it so right click on your windows start menu open up the task manager and here right now i will close two xf files or two processes first is rain meter so if you click here on the processes and type in r here you will see that we have rain meter still running make sure that you click here and the task but still i need to end the taskbar xi so make sure to search for that as well so taskbar xi right click and end the task so right now we can close the task manager click on the rain meter and uninstall from there and for the taskbar xi open up this pc local disk c and remove this folder that we created previously with that said thank you for watching till the end for all the files used in this video, I will leave a link in video description and while you are down there, make sure that you click that subscribe button and like this video for the YouTube algorithm. And you can also support me on coffee.com, link in video description as well. Have an amazing rest of your day and I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.